Hiya guys, welcome back to my channel if you're new here, welcome. So as you can see from today's title, we'll be doing a sheeting haul. Now I did order these items quite a while back. I think it was like at the start of June. Um, I think just as about like lockdown and that was like starting to be talked about in terms of like coming like slowly releasing out of lockdown and things like that. So I did want to make an order because I had seen like loads of Shein hauls. Like I love watching hauls personally. And um, I had seen a load of hauls. I had seen a bunch of like Instagram pictures and loads of my friends that had been buying from them. And I wanted to try it because I had tried out previously their gym wear, which if you haven't watched that video, I think that's probably one of my most viewed videos and you guys really enjoyed that, um, which thank you for watching that one. Um, so I wanted to do more clothes based because that last one was gym wear and I'm still a massive fan of them. Still wear the gym leggings the gray ones that i showed you in my last one um but yeah i did order a sheen haul i did get quite a few items i only spent about 150 pounds but i did get a lot obviously they've got sales on you can use discount codes things like that so yeah if you want to see what i picked up from sheen sorry this intro is really long then please keep on watching so um the first item that we have on well we have it on <laughs> is this top right here if i bring the camera down and show you this is the top that I picked up. Um, I'm gonna give you all the prices and things. I've still got my Shein phone case that I have been really enjoying. Um, so we have here this top, which is a Cartonette Graphic Boyfriend tee. I got this, this is in a one size. I'm like, I guess it's like a one size if it's all. Is it gonna probably fit everyone? Probably not. Um, for me, this feels like a oversized small more like a medium like if it was an oversized t-shirt this would be a small if this was a normal t-shirt like graphic tee this would probably be a medium um as you see it comes down around about here um i have got a stain on it already i have been wearing this this i really really like i think it was just the whole car vibe that i really went for um the quality doesn't look as good as it does in the picture because i'm guessing that's an instagram influencer model all of that but yeah this was really nice this was 10 pound 20 originally 11 pound 99 would I recommend this? Yeah, if you like your graphic tees. What I like is it, it, I feel as if this isn't gonna, like after a few washes gonna fall apart. It doesn't have that feel, it's just like within the material. Like I think it's the ink, or I don't know, I'm not specialised in clothing, but yeah. This I would recommend, I really do like it. It's just a classic t-shirt material. Um, I've really enjoyed wearing this. I think this was a little bit bigger when I got it, but of course I'm guessing things shrink in that. But it's just a cool little lounge piece. Of course you can just like either do it up, or something like that but yeah i really really like this i thought for a tenner why not um it does give me like plt i saw it first boohoo misguided vibes so yeah if you like that then this is great i know she in sorry you can't really see my face that much i know she in do quite a lot of graphic tees so yeah this one was a great one i did just buy some nipple covers um i think this was a pack of 15 um let me have a look so i did grab some this is a pack of 10 this was two pound 55 originally two pound 99 they're like different shaped i think one's like a flowery one's a circle shaped nipple covers i really really like these for my own dresses and things like that so yeah i just grabbed these so we next have this top now as you can see it is incredibly see-through um i could have put nipple covers with it but i didn't so this here is the draw screw oh, draw drawstring not front floral print crop top this was £4.67 I'm guessing like with Sheen you get what you pay for sort of quality wise for those that are asking I haven't got any makeup on today I couldn't be bothered um but this is originally £5.49 got this in a size medium it fits how a medium would to be honest like it's not too too bad if you have kind of cleavage like you've got bigger boobs or like average size boobs not small if you haven't got if you haven't got small boobs um, or even if you have small boobs, I tend to find that there's a tiny bit too much fabric here, but it's not going to bother me. The arms are really tight though, so I would have rather this extra fabric be here. Doesn't seem poorly made. Um, I do like the whole pull string vibe. I think that's why I went for it. However, personally, I just wanted to go out of my comfort zone with like a floral top. Is this it? No. Um, I'm probably going to send this one back just because this isn't really my jam. You can see my bra. I've got like a strapless bra on from New Look, the one I got on my ASOS one. But yeah, this feels nice though it doesn't feel like the best quality it does feel really really nice it does feel like something to pick up from like pretty little thing or whatnot but yeah the quality isn't terrible the sizing is actually okay like i generally size your size the arms are a tiny bit tight like ever so slightly like you can barely notice it though but yeah 
This is a cute little top and of course you can just do the knot up however you want. So yeah, we next have this. This is the tie-dye rib knit crop top in a size medium again. Um, this was £4.67, originally £5.49. Again, really, really cheap. The rib material is great. Like I'm not having any issues with it. Um, the sizing is a bit much like, for example, there is no give, like there is, this is fitted, but then on this side, it's just a bit too much fabric. I don't know, maybe that's just me yeah do you see it too there's just a little bit extra fabric here i feel as if um i should have got a small in this but then again i'm like I, you should just size your usual size it's not too cropped which is great for me like i don't really like too too cropped but at the same time i kind of like this i don't know where i'm on it i don't know if i'm going to keep it i don't know if i'm going to give it away like send it back so yeah i'll just see how i'm feeling i do like this though i think for five pounds it's not too too bad the quality isn't amazing but it's not terrible it's definitely your typical rib ribbed material it's not see-through okay it might be slightly see-through okay i'm just seeing that now this is probably going to go back but yeah it's slightly see-through which isn't amazing but i feel as if you have to wear a bra of this like if i wanted to use my nipple covers or like wear no bra of it i'd have to size down but if you have a bra on or like a strapless bra then size your size but again i don't know if you guys can see on this side there's no like extra fabric but on this side there is a good amount of extra fabric so and it looks kind of slanted does it Maybe it's just, yeah, I feel as if it needs to be up here and then it would look equal, but yeah, not great. We next have this guy, which again, see through. I don't understand why this wasn't see through when I first tried it on. Um, I'm not a huge fan of this bra that I've got on, but it's just going to use, I'm just using it for the actual videos. Um, so this here is the lettuce trim drawstring knot hem uh rib knit top this was 5.99 and i got it for five pound ten obviously because discount um i think the discounts don't really do much but obviously when they go to checkout it does but um yeah i like the color and i like how it looks and i like the little like designs here it looks really really flattering it's not too too low and of course you can use the drawstring and then pull it up which is probably what i was going for but then i also quite like it just normally i like this tone of like blue however i'm just noticing as you can see it is see-through which is not what I want. So yeah, this is another one that will be going back, but the quality seems okay. It's slightly itchy, just ever so slightly. Not too, too much of an itch, like barely there, but when you originally put it on, you're like, oh, maybe this would itch you on a certain day. So. so we next have this guy, which I'm not gonna lie to you. I have no, yeah. This is the tie-dye ribbed crop tank top by, oh, she and her. I got this in a medium. As you can see, if I lift up my arms, this goes up and even if I put it down, it rides up again. The quality, I'm not gonna lie to you, it's thicker. Again, it's see-through. I'm wondering if this is the bra, but it's also the material as well. Like, the material is so different to the usual one, but I don't know why there's no, it doesn't suck you in here. Like it's supposed to be fitted and it's really not. Like if I lift up my arm, you can see my bra. I even think if I was to not have a bra and just have like the nipple covers or just like no bra at all, as soon as I lift up, you'd see under boob, which is not what I'm going for. I don't really like that vibe. It's very cropped. It's literally just sitting below the boob area. Um, and yeah, there's no give in it at all, which is not what I live for. And again, there's just, yeah, it's not great. Um, but then again, you are getting what you pay for. So yeah, this is another one that will be going back. Overall, like I like the style of these. I don't know what I was thinking here, but yeah, you can just see. If I lift up my arms, this just... And I'm not be I'm not gonna be standing there in a shop going all day. It's just not it. So next we have this guy, which I'm not gonna lie to you. When I looked um through what I'd purchased, I then looked again to then I was like, when did I order this? Now this is supposed to be the flutter sleeve wrap wrap not dalmatian crop top this was 7.99 but i got it for six pound 80. now on the model i'm going to show you on the model this looked as if it was going to be cropped to about here but my boobs are literally there like if i was to move this wire down here it's literally there this obviously i've never really used one i've never really had one of these before so i don't know how to wrap them or anything like that but this just isn't it like i like the detailing here but then it's sort of just is not as long as i thought it would be like it doesn't i would rather it be like out here and coming off and obviously it just falls down like it's not the prettiest it's not flattering as much it's kind of flattering on the boobs though like if i was to do it up properly it's kind of flattering on the boobs but yeah i got this in a medium if I feel as if these tops are like stuff that I like, but I need them to be a bit lower. Again, I'm not really too happy with the quality, and I think also there is a damaged 
whereas it is on this side there is a hole there which i'm just like she in what are we doing right now like what are we playing at here but yeah this is probably one that's cute i like the style of it i kind of like these things i don't really go through too much but i would prefer it to be down here so next we have this one which i'm actually all for i really really enjoy this one this is the newspaper print crop top like tank top in a size medium this was 4.99 but i got it for £4.25 um this is really nice it's not really that see-through obviously i wouldn't wear this bra with it i'm just wearing it for the purpose of the video just so i can easily try on things love the style it's not too too much give obviously i could just put this in the wash and it will fit around me perfectly but yeah it's a tiny bit big i would say size down personally this is a medium and it sort of fits like it's nice area around here but i would want this to be a tiny bit tighter i like how cropped it is it's not too cropped i like how this looks on me all great not really any complaints obviously there's still a tiny bit like excess fabric but i generally think that's because of the bra that i'm wearing um but yeah no issues so far i kind of like this not sending this one back finally um so yeah next off we have this guy which i think everyone and their mum has this is the dragon graphic oversized tee i've been loving the grab and dragon vibe lately this is what the top looks like i got this in a size medium i could have got a small i like how the arms fall like obviously i am not a massive fan of my arms but i like how this looks on me um this was a seven pound 54 instead of eight pound 99 of course you can get sheen discounts yeah i love it i like the material it's different from the original graphic tee that i showed you it's different from this material it's more silky like more it's not really going to be too shrinkish in the wash. I like this. I'm going to, probably going to wear this a lot. Probably wear these with a pair of jeans. Or I could just knot it up. But yeah, it's very great for £7. You can't really go wrong. I like the quality. The quality isn't terrible. Fits lovely. Like the detailing. So yeah, all things are good there. I bought this like like lingerie set. Which I wanted to try because I thought I'm not really a lingerie girl. But um, just because for who please. But um, I bought this this was the four lace lingerie set i thought it's 7.99 it's probably going to be not that great but it's actually okay i have the underwear bit but i've already worn i kind of like the underwear bit let me see if i can find it for you in a minute but yeah i like this this was eight six pound 80 originally seven pound 99 i got this in a medium um my bust size is around a 34d so yeah these fit quite nicely i like the underwear there's not really too many problems with it i just don't like how it's structured around here so like when it goes around because then it it sucks me in quite tight and then i get little a bit of jiggle jiggle which i don't really mind i quite like but yeah these are quite nice i prefer the bottoms to the top i'll show you the bottoms now bottoms are a lot more comfier than the top part um i've i've already worn the bottoms before they're really really comfy the wiring the the straps are really really comfy there's no digginess there's no anything uncomfortable like the thong sits really really lovely so that's great but yeah i haven't really tried the bra yet but yeah i can't really complain i've heard that she underwear is quite good so yeah i'm all up for that but yeah these i quite like now we then have this two-toned car and letter graphic tee very very similar to the original first one we got but again this one is difference two-toned i went blank there um i'm not too sure about how i like this i think i like this off rather than on i think it's not really me i know they do this in a black and white i should have got the black and white one but i think at the time the gray was the only one i had this is a size medium it's very like fitted it's more feels like a small rather than a medium so i probably size up if you want that oversized feel which is what i was going for this was originally 9.99 but i got it for five pound ten which isn't too too bad but yeah this it feels all right the stitching looks okay it's quite good quality material am i gonna wear this probably not so this is probably going to be another one that will go back we next have this guy which again is see-through it's the bra i know it's the bra um but this is a one shoulder rib knit top i'm not sure if it's supposed to be on this shoulder or that shoulder so it was four pound 99 um now well, i got it for four pound 25 this is in a size medium i would say size your size but also if you want just that extra fittedness i'd say size down because there is a little bit of give here but i like this i feel the material is very very nice it's something i'd probably find in like primark or zara i generally feel like this needs to be over here but yeah it's not terrible um I'm not sure if it fits my jam. I feel as if I've got too much showing here, which is just my personal preference anyway. But yeah, I feel, let me just try and see if I can put it on this side. Let's see what it looks like. Okay, so I think it looks slightly nicer like this, I think, on this side. But yeah, it's not terrible. I, I do like it. Is it my jam? Probably not. But yeah i do like it I just feel as if it's just too much for me personally here and of course you can either wear like a, 
uh, your skin tone type of bra or like nipple covers and whatnot but yeah it's really really nice the material is really really nice as well it's not too too like it's not tacky in any way shape or form so yeah not bad so i think the last clothing piece before we no not the last clothing piece the second to last clothing piece before we move on to um bikini and pajamas um i got this which is a oh, one shoulder tie dye rib knit top this was £5.49 but I got it for £4.67 I got a medium this probably is my favourite one out of all of them like all of the rib materials that I've showed you this is really really nice again I think I should have sized down to a small but it's not a problem it does look kind of cute on I don't know what it is I just thought maybe the whole one shoulder vibe would suit me but I just don't like it I feel as if there's just too much here for my comfortability so yeah I will be sending this one back if it had the two straps then I'd be happy but yeah it is really really cute probably look nice on a lot of other people I do like it but again it's just too much here for me I don't know what I was thinking <laughs> next time this pajama set um I I'm not 100% sure what I feel about this. I think this looks cuter on the like on the pictures rather than it did on me. Should have sized up. The shorts are absolutely tiny. So it's like these blue, what do they call them? These are the um, contrast binding satin pajama set. I do like these. These were £8.50, originally £10. Um, I was just, I just feel as if I should have sized up. I did get these in medium. I should have got these in a large, which is a bit disappointing. And they do ride up your bum. Um, these are very, very tight. These, the, the actual shirt itself doesn't give any give, which obviously satin doesn't really anyway, so you've got to get used to it. But I like this type of pyjamas. Probably might even get these again in the future, but yeah, these again are going back just because they just don't feel comfortable. Ooh, just don't feel comfortable for what I'd want in a pyjama set. A bikini set as well. So this is something that's very, very out of my comfort zone. I'm, I'm probably going to keep this just because I might be going on holiday in the future. And yeah, but I don't know. I'm still 50-50 on it. Just because, one, this is the bra, top of the bra bit. Now, I'm going to explain rather than showing, actually, I'll show it to you. Now, I've always liked the sides of my boots um, in general. I think they are quite nice. I would have preferred this to be an actual knot where you could tighten this in just because I feel as if it needs to look like that. Because if I wear this normally, there is literally just so much fabric that is just not necessary and these don't really sit very nicely either like i'm uncomfortable i just know like if i was in a pool or whatnot um these are just gonna pop up it looks nice i do really really like this um i generally feel like the model looked a lot better than me in them but yeah i don't really go for bikinis that much um sheen i know is a place to shop but i'd rather this be a little bit like tighter like maybe like that that'd be a bit better but there's no strap back here like the strap rides up i don't know why and if i put it down then this bit goes up so overall it's a little bit like ill-fitting and this should have been an actual knot but it's just excess fabric that you can take off you don't actually have to have it on um which is a bit of a bummer but yeah it's not terrible i quite like the design on it it looks very very flat like the cut the tone looks quite flattering on me the bottoms i had no problem with whatsoever um they were they fit really really nicely and so forth like there was there was no uncomfortability um i did get this in a size medium which wasn't terrible but yeah um they're not my favorites i think it's just the top half that i get struggle with a lot with bikinis just because i tend to get this extra Thing because I think because I'm quite slim, the boob size that I have is quite big for what I am meant to be frame wise. So yeah, um, these are going to be either keeping or going back. I'm just going to have a little look and go, yeah, maybe or maybe not. The last actual item we have are a pair of trousers. I'm going to show you now. Now I have no idea why I got these. I think because I'm going to insert an image of what they look like in a minute. I think it was the image that was like, oh my god, yes, I really wanted like a straight pair of jeans. And now I love my straight jeans anyway, but I really wanted just a pair of jeans that like were long enough. And I thought to myself, I looked at the inches on and that's what i like about inches because they do the measurements which i don't really see in a lot of other brands they might be slightly off but for these ones they weren't um, i am six foot two for those that don't know and i bought these pair of jeans that i'm going to show you in a minute now there is so much fabric going on i think these were like 20 pounds i think i'm going to show you obviously insert a picture of what they look like on the model and then how they look like on me but yeah, these are just a massive no. Use the fluffy socks that I have on my feet, if you can see them. These right here are the jeans that we have going on. Um, they're not exactly high-waisted. They're just like mid. So my waist is around here. So they're very like low-rise in a sense. They're not high-waisted at all. Which actually, I'm not going to lie to you. 
I don't actually mind, but they don't really flatter me in a way. They don't really cinch me in. I got this in a size medium, I think. Let's have a look. I got these in a size medium. So these are the light wash baggy jeans. These are originally 19 pounds, but I got them for 16. Um, there is just so much fabric going on in this area of the leg. Like there's just so much, like my leg is here, but there's just so much fabric and they're giving me like quite, I don't know, like, yeah, these are just not for me. Um, there's so much fabric at the bottom. They needed to be a little bit more straighter then I would have actually kept them. But yeah, they're not terrible, just they don't look flattering on me at all. And I have, and for me, I'm quite happy with my figure, but these make me go, oh no, like definitely not. And if I had a bloated belly, this is these are not gonna be the ones. So yeah, the quality is great though. I like the color. The quality is actually quite nice for these jeans um, and for Shein. They don't look, it doesn't look unflattering on the bum or anything like that. But yeah, these are gonna be a massive no-no. Thing from my Shein haul, I think, let me just have a quick look. Um, I think originally, I think it actually came up to £102 actually, which is pretty nice. And I'm not sure how many items I got all together, but yeah. If you want me to do more hauls and things like that, please let me know. Let me know if you enjoyed this video. Please give it a massive thumbs up if you did. It really helps me out. Share with all your friends. Um, comment in the comment section if you're going to do any hauls or if you're interested, if you liked any of the items that I got. All the items will be linked in, linked in the description. This video is not sponsored in any way. I purchased these items with my own money. I've not worked with Shein in this video at all in any way shape or form so yeah i really, really hope you enjoyed this video let me know your thoughts and i shall see you in my next one bye